With rain, wind and cold weather hitting the Central Coast, a warming shelter is opening up in Santa Cruz this weekend, providing those without a home a place to keep dry. Action News reporter Kyla Linville is live at the Calvary Episcopal Church where the center will be set up. She has more on what the shelter is providing. Kyla. Well, Christopher, this is a pop up shelter, so it is temporary for just this weekend. But in just about an hour, volunteers will be setting up a space in the church right behind me right here where they'll be providing people with food and a warm place to rest. As chilly temperatures and rain set in, not everyone has a roof over their head to keep warm, which is why a warming center is opening at the Calvary Episcopal Church in downtown Santa Cruz for the homeless. This is a hypothermia center. Our mission is to reduce the experience of hypothermia and the occurrence of death. Uh, and we're seeing a lot of that uh, because the shelter system maxes out currently at 50 people. But here they can take care of even more people. On a moment's notice, we were sheltering about 80 people, but for, we're actually designed to open for cold snaps of, of freezing weather. And if we see the cold snap coming, our system can support 200 people on an, in, in a night. This entire room will be filled with sleeping mats and blankets and volunteers serving hot soup all night long. And in the morning upon waking, we do have some donation items, uh, hand warmers to, for people to take out. And then we offer actual coffee and chicken soup again in the morning and then pastries. The program prioritizing people who have a harder time getting around. So we also reach out to people. Uh, we have a shuttle that can accommodate people with uh, wheelchairs and walkers. So we'll be going out intentionally looking for those people. But when they come in, we prioritize, prioritize people with uh, mobility challenges. And with more wet weather on the way, Adam says they'll likely be back. We expect to be open somewhere between 20 and 30, 40 days this winter. Uh, we have hundreds of people, so this is profoundly important and we want the community to be aware of it. Now, as the rain continues just a little bit later on, it will pick up and obviously it's very windy right now outside. And because of these reasons, Adam says that they won't be turning anyone away this evening. Now, this pop up shelter will be open tonight and tomorrow night at eight o'clock. Christopher. All right, thank you, Kyla. Yeah, you can really see that wind whipping up out there. Uh, the program is looking for more volunteers and donations. You can visit their website at warmingcenterprogram.com. You can also call their hotline. The number's on your screen if you would like more information.